Hello. Good morning. Is this Lauren? It is. I feel like such a stalker. Lauren, it's Bristol from Gary and Bristol in the morning on Kiss Country. How are you? Good. How are you? You're probably like, why has this person been calling my phone since 645 this well, morning? I just found my phone and I was like, what in the world? <laughs> well, Lauren Jackson, I was hoping that you would have a minute that I could read something to you. Okay. It's from a woman named Reba Tullis. Do you know Reba? I do. Well, Reba sure thinks a lot of you because she nominated you for this week's Caught in the Act Award. Okay. Can I, can I read this to you? You can. In 2009, I had breast cancer, and she went above and beyond everything to help me with finances. She stepped up and did many fundraisers to help me get by and pay bills. She also put on a benefit softball game last year in my honor. She had twin girls and was pregnant with her third baby, and it never stopped her from helping me. Our niece just graduated high school, and she also helped make it possible for her to get her very first car. Today, she and some friends went and passed out water and food to some homeless people. I've always wanted to do something special for her, and right now I'm still struggling with things since I haven't been able to return to work yet. She will give anyone the shirt off of her back, and she still manages to take care of her three kids. Wow. Lauren, that is from Reba Tullis, and I'm going to tell you what, I do believe she has caught you in the act, my friend. <laughs> I, I don't even know what to say. <laughs> Well, we started this program, I guess, probably about three or four months ago. Every Thursday, we recognize someone here in our community who makes Kiss Country a better place to live. And you, my friend, are guilty. <laughs> Got hope. <laughs> Try. <laughs> People are watching. <laughs> They're noticing what you're doing, Lauren. <laughs> Well, I know you don't do it for the recognition, but um, we do want to shine a light on you and the good things that you're doing here in our area. And I know it's not enough, but we have a $100 gift certificate from David Alvis at Silver Star Steakhouse that we want to give you. Well, thank you. That means a lot.